Hi, this video is all about top roping and leading here at the castle and some of the issues surrounding those activities we'd like to make you aware of. Before we start, it's important to note that this is in no way a substitution for professional instruction. If you'd like to learn how to top rope or to lead, please book onto one of our courses. As I'm sure you've noticed, the center can get quite busy. Not busy right now, obviously, because we're making a video. But thanks to cutting edge technology, we can now simulate for you a busy period here at the castle. There we are, super busy. Hi, Tom. Hi. Tom's gonna demonstrate. Tom, you don't actually need your ice axe for this demonstration. Tom's gonna to demonstrate walking around the center during a busy period. The key points here are keep your eyes up, stay out of the auto belay landing zones, and walk around the back of belayers. You ready, Tom? I think so. Good luck. Nice work. When you're belaying, start belaying, Tom. Wait, have you checked each other? Of course. When you're belaying, make sure you always remain a safe distance from the wall. If you're too far away from the wall, then you risk being pulled forward if your climber falls. You also make life difficult for other people trying to move around the centre. Watch this. Walk away from the wall, please, Tom. Too far away. And forward, please. Well done, Tom. One more time. Back away from the wall. And forward. Of course, no matter whether you're top roping or leading, and whatever belay device you're using, always keep at least one hand on the dead rope in the locked position at all times. Once again, Tom will demonstrate. Now, in your own time, Tom, don't let go of the dead rope. Nailed it. Communication between climber and bee layer is yeah, also. Got you. Go on up. Keep talking to each other because that. Yeah, yeah, I'm watching. Keep those lines of communication open. Go to the right. No, to the right. Never mind. Come on, Tom. Let's go leading. That was really good, I thought you did really well. Yeah, it went then. quite smooth. Yeah, it was good then. Leading is more serious than top roping. The forces involved are much greater for both climber and bee layer. Uh, go. It is absolutely vital to keep your attention on your climber at all times and always be ready to catch a fall. Vis a vis. Unless you are actually climbing, please stay out of the lead climbing areas. Always remember to flake your rope out before you start climbing so to avoid any tangles. How long is your rope, Tom? 400 meters. 400 meters, okay. So. Well, the walls are 12 meters high. We've got to come back down again afterwards. Yeah, so you need twice as much. So that's 12 times two. We'll, we'll add a little bit more on. Well, top. you need about 30 meters. 30. Oh, and then 400 meters is long should, enough. It should be long enough, yeah. Yeah, yeah so, yeah. so flake your rope out. Uh, yeah. Where's the end? Just like top roping, don't forget your buddy checks. Vital before you start any rock climb. Tom, have you brought your buddy with you today? And if you haven't brought your buddy with you, you and your beeler can carry out your checks yourselves. Thanks, Tom's buddy. Whilst lead belaying, if there isn't enough slack in the system, the climber will struggle to move up the wall. 
and if they were to fall, it could be uncomfortable and it may result in injury. However, if there's too much slack in the system, then there is potential for the climber to hit the floor. Always remember, keep monitoring the slack while you're belaying. Just keep asking yourself the question, what would happen if my climber falls right now? Finally, the most important thing to remember when you're climbing in the castle is stay within the remit of your skills. So, if you don't know how to top rope or lead, do take an appropriate course before you give it a go. If you ever get into difficulties, please don't hesitate to ask a member of staff. Remember, you're not halfway up a mountain somewhere, you're in the middle of London. So just shout help, like this. Help! Ooh. Gonna put the helmet to so is that okay? You're gonna yep. be all right, yeah? You okay, Tom? Great. Thanks for watching, everyone.